Okay, so how much to how much do you want for it? Yeah, for a website like this, the agency we charge around like five fifty to like seven hundred dollars for a website like this. But the reason I contact you guys is because I saw the really low prices, so I thought it won't be the same here, but it will be something around it. But I mean, here in Israel, for one hundred dollars, and it will be really good. Uh, so taking seven hundred dollars for a webflow website is really high and not worth the price. I got a bang review for you guys. Make sure to watch it till the end, but I'm gonna put a snippet of what happened at the end, right? We talked about um, a website, he reached out to me on Fiverr, right? This is why I tell you guys don't use Fiverr, don't use these platforms because you have the worst clients, right? But it's partially my fault as well. Like, I put the prices there, so he reached out to me wanted to create a website. And my pricing, my actual pricing for a website, I had as much complexity as he wanted. And his price in his mind was way different. So make sure to watch a full video and see things you should do and not do. So make sure you guys enjoy the video. See y'all soon. Peace. Hi, how are you? Hello. Great to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. Yeah. So uh, the reason we are doing this video meeting is just to make sure you understand all the features here. Uh, is that fine for you? Yeah. Great. So first of all, if you can send me a bit more of your work, it will be great. A few more uh, you can send it over here or over or in Fiverr, whatever works for you. I don't care. Um, I just want to make sure, make sure you don't send any messages on Fiverr that relate that's saying that we are talking over here because that's against Fiverr rule, and I don't want them to ban your account. So that's okay. a, that's I'll do that uh, using Figma and not directly in Fiverr. Okay. So, yeah. and we will we'll do all the communication from now and on using WhatsApp or in Fiverr, but uh, the payment and other things will be in Fiverr, okay? Okay. Yeah, I was saying, I'll give you to check those two that I sent earlier. Uh, you send me some uh, things where in WhatsApp or in Fiverr? Fiverr, I sent to, but I'll send like two, one more. You can just check like, is that like the last three projects you've done? Okay. I'm sending in the chat right now, so. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> Have you got to the links? Oh, you sent you sent it here. You see. Yeah, in the chat. In the chat. Okay. One second. And you, you did all of this? Yeah. Actually, I've got an agency. We work with so many clients. We do like SEO, web designer. We also help them manage their social media pages. So those, we have done a lot of Shopify stores also, but we are working on some of them. So I'm not really happy sending them right now because mm -hmm. But these three, yeah, I'll check this. Okay. So let me just go through the design. Uh, maybe I will share the screen. Okay. So let me share okay. the screen. Let me try to make you the host right. Yeah, yeah the host right now, so you can share your screen. So you can follow with me along with me. Okay. So at the beginning, I only need one page. So that's the first page, and that's the mobile version. Okay. Uh, okay. These page will be will come later. So let's first start with these ones. You can you see how we have a read more. So these things should uh, take you here. But for now, let's start only with the simple, uh, the first one, okay? Okay. Great. So here it's a usual header. That's just, are you familiar with Wix? I, I guess I just put it as a placeholder. Yeah. So the, I did the design, so. <laughs> so wow, that's good, just, that's good. Thanks, uh, just make sure you're not using it any anywhere else it's mine and it's uh, protected in copyright so yeah yeah uh, you're not allowed to to share to use it so great so that's that's website is for my startup and uh, it's supposed to be the first landing page and uh and uh here it's not images it's supposed to be videos because there's not uh, options to do videos in the figma okay. so these are videos and the the animation that's supposed to happen as when you hover on something, it's supposed to increase. So that will become bigger and uh, and this one will become like 
like that. Okay. I guess you understand. That. So when you hover, I, I can show you an example. Let me see if I can find it better. One second. Maybe that one. See? No. Maybe that. No. Here, I think that one. Okay. So you can see how here. Yeah. video but without sound and if i want to add sound i can click here and that will add the sound as well okay, okay. so yep. we might do it that way maybe maybe i'm still thinking about it maybe he will need to press and hold you know just to do sound same in tiktok and, and that's making a sound okay is that yeah. clear is that that's fine is that possible in webflow yeah, for the sound, I think that should be good. You can actually add the button to make the sound like when you hover over it or when you click on it, you can bring out the sound. So it's, that should be done quite so easily. Well, we, we, we will find a way, I guess. Now, so that's the most complex part. Now, here we have simple uh, uh, just information. This is how it shows when it's hover. So this is a hover state. So when okay. you hover, so this will go up here and will be shrinked to, uh, I don't know, to 20 to 20. And then the, the text will be revealed. So now you, you don't need to do the animation. You can just reveal both of them like that. Just reveal. Okay. So you the opacity of here this one will become zero and the opacity of this one and this one will become one and you will add the background and do like a nice transition. So like a nice animation or something like that, okay? Okay. And this, please create this button, but right now it won't redirect him anywhere. Just it will stay here, okay? Okay. Great. Now here is the same animation, but as you can see, it's a bit different design. So instead of being here, it's under here and we have a number here. And when he hovers, it's also so show some text. Okay. Right? Yeah. You yeah. can for now just you just can just use lorem ipsum to for the text. You don't need to do something as you can see, you don't have all the text, so just invent some uh, text by yourself. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Here, so here is also a bit complex. Here you have a slider. So as you can see, when you there will be free videos, it's also the same videos like here. And okay. when you do a video. We, you click here and it changes the videos, okay? There will yeah, be yeah. free and there will be like, like a slider, a carousel. And this doesn't need to change. This will be the same. Okay. Okay. Yes, now, sir. this is the same as here. So you can just duplicate it, and but it will, it will be with different videos, but you can duplicate the functionality. Yeah. Uh, one more thing, just make sure you see here it shows a full name and here it doesn't. So okay. the full name only revealed after he hovers. So when he hover, it sh also shows a full name. But for now, it's only so sh shows a, the company. So okay. as you can see, the company is switching side, and here it will be full name. I guess you can see. You see, so it was here. It switched over here, and then the full name revealed. Yeah. Great. And that's also pretty simple. No hover effects, nothing here. You can just leave it the way it is. Uh, you can see it's like a smiley. It's like a nice yeah, round. Yeah. Effect. I, I did it by doing like a cards, so four cards, and just you can use tra uh, margins and things like that just to, to push them down. Yeah. Great. And lastly, frequently asked questions. Same here. It's really easy. It's like a grid. Uh, and also that's easy and a footer. Now, as for the mobile version, so there's some few changes. Here it, you see it's changes into carousels. So this will become a carousel. Okay. Uh, this will be like that. And also the the testimonies will be carousels. Okay. These ones. And of course, this is also a slider. Yeah. Okay. And this is how it looks, uh, that, that thing. It will look like that. And of course, the user can swipe. Like it goes like that. Okay. And maybe you don't need to do like a, the animation. Maybe maybe all of them can be the same size. You know, maybe here 
all of them will be the same size and you can just uh, make sure you're doing that, okay? Yeah. Great. So the frequently asked question like that and the last part and that's it. Okay. Great. So everything is clear? Yeah, makes sense. Great, thanks. So, yeah. and of course you can do like, uh, here's a hamburger and like do nice animation if you can. Like, okay. Maybe it's like a crossing and you know, there are many cool animations yeah, 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 yeah. you can do here. And uh, that's it basically. Uh, for these ones, we we can we will do them later. So if this if you will do a great job in that one, I will or make a new order on Fiverr and we can do, and we can and keep working together. Okay. All right. Great. So how much do how much do you want for it? I saw you have free packages. So you have. Let me go. Which one it is? You have. Where is uh, the Webflow thing? This one. So I saw you have uh, basic, which is free pages. Uh, you have standard six pages interactive animation and mobile responsive and 10 pages mind-blowing interactive animation mobile responsive which one uh the which one do you want yeah actually this price is on the price actually charge i just put this because i don't actually use five other options so like i just left them these are actually the prices i charge for website designs these aren't the prices you charge no absolutely <laughs> No. So just to understand why you why you put them here? Yeah, like I, I don't actually use five other from you can check almost all my gigs, they're like five dollars. I don't I just put them just to have like a profile so Okay, so how how much do you charge for such a website? Yeah, for a website like this, the agency we charge around like five fifty to like seven hundred dollars for a website like this currently. <laughs> seven hundred dollars. Yep. But I think it's not this, relevant. That, that photography website that I showed you was like one three. So, but that is that, that has a lot more pages than this, so it shouldn't be that expensive. Yeah, but, but the reason I contact you guys is because I saw the really low prices, so I thought it won't be the same here, but it will be something around it. But uh, that's not the prices you promised here. You see, as you can see, it's fifteen dollars for ten pages. I, I know it's too much, but you shouldn't do the the pricing here. Yeah, sorry about that. Yeah, so I don't think we would be able to work together. Seven hundred dollars is something I can get here, even cheaper. I can get something in here in Israel for one hundred dollars, and it will be really good. Uh, so taking seven hundred dollars for a webflow website is really high and not worth the price. If you do, if you want, I can do fifteen and twenty dollars. That that's the prices. That's how people uh, offer in Fiverr and the most expensive ones doing 100. It's just a simple website on Fiverr, uh, on a Webflow. You don't do in code, you don't do anything besides that. So if you want, contact me on WhatsApp, but I, I won't pay more than $20. So let me know if that's something that uh, can help you, but uh, actually I'm pretty annoyed right now that uh, you made me spend my time on that because I thought that would be the prices. So you can contact me on WhatsApp. Uh, I won't go higher than 20 and uh, please let me know if that, that's something you want to do. Uh, I do have many more projects besides that one, so it's not going to be the first one. Uh, so your call, send me a WhatsApp message if you're changing your mind. Okay. okay. Thank you for your time. Bye-bye.